Hi everyone, since November you haven't seen me on Two Minutes of Truth and here now that I am in India I want to come back and I say hi to you, happy to see you all again. Well actually I don't really see you but you see me. So today it's a very difficult gospel to understand. I'm sure you've been to Mass this morning and you are scandalized, you are shocked, you are confused by what Jesus said. He praised the guy, the steward who was unjust, dishonest, deceitful? Hmm, is it a new gospel? So please, Jesus, give us your light. How can he say that the master praised the dishonest servant? Whoa! So, first of all, at the difference of the prodigal son, the dishonest servant has not said, I'm sorry, master, I have been deceitful. Please forgive me. I'm not worthy to be your steward. Mm -mm -mm. He didn't repent. The prodigal son did repent. Now, what is Jesus saying? Does he celebrate dishonesty? Does he celebrate those who cheat and are shrewd enough to secure their future? Mm -mm. This is the highlight of the virtue of prudence that Jesus wants us to apply it as sons and daughters of light, those who live in truth, those who want to live in truth, they need to do much better than that guy who was prudent in order to secure his future when he was off his job, to make friends by making them pay much less than they should pay. So Jesus asks us in other terms, if that guy did the wrong things, but very shrewdly he was smart to secure his future on earth. Should we not choose the right means out of prudence to be sure to enter heaven and to please God in everything? So, we can die tomorrow, we can die in one week. Have we made the best choices in our life to secure our future? God bless you all.